Hi, welcome to Mike's Garage. What I'm going to talk to you about today is how to prime a 4.6 and a 5 liter Coyote uh, oil system the proper way so that when you start the car it gets instant oil pressure. Start off with the factory has a sending unit right here. You can see my fingers on it. You pull that sending unit out, okay, and then you get this, one of these units like this. This is a this is a pressurized canister. You pour oil in here, you take this out, you pour oil in it. Then over here, you put pressurized air in it, okay? Once you get the pressurized air in, this screws up where you just pulled that, screws up into the hole where you just pulled that oil pressure sending unit out. You turn this valve on and you'll hear the oil start rushing into the engine. And that's all well and good, except Except for this, Ford specified on their oil filters to have an anti-drain back valve. What that does is when you're pressurizing it, the oil is backfilled into the oil filter and it hits this and stops it. So it never makes its way down into the oil pump. So when I was doing this the first time, I realized that there was a problem with it because I wasn't getting any oil pressure when I was cranking it over, but I'd primed it. So what I did was I went up and I bought an oil filter and I took a Dremel tool and you can see I've Dremeled through to where you can actually see through into the oil filter. Right here, 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 all around there. You can see where I've drilled through and you can see the oil filter. So what happens now is the oil goes down in here and then comes back up through here and you can hear it bubbling into the bottom of the oil pan now. So we've just done this, we've just primed it. I took the old filter off or put, took this filter off and put the original filter back on it. Now we're going to crank it over and see if we get any oil pressure. Got pressure. 40. And there you have it. That's the easiest way to do it. Thanks a lot for watching, and we'll talk to you again soon.